Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix when you try to install any games from Xbox app and when you click on install, you don't see your external hard drive over here. So you see the screen which says choose a drive and you only see your C drive but not your external drive over here. So when you click on it, you see this, you see the option like this which gives you an option to change and you can select the external drive so if you're not getting this option then please follow the steps shown in this video now the first step is to restart your computer so go to the start menu click on the power icon then click on system restart and after the system restart try to install the game to external drive next step is to select the drive in windows settings for this go to the start menu and then click on settings now click on system and then click on storage now once you click on storage in windows 10 at the bottom you will find the option which says change where new content is saved in windows 11 click on advanced storage settings and then you will see the option which says where new content is saved now over here you can go ahead and select your external drive so select your external drive and then click on apply now you can try to install the game still you are facing the problem then select the drive in xbox settings so open xbox app on the top left here you can see your profile icon click on it then click on settings now go to general tab scroll down over here you can see change where this app install games by default click on this drop down option and select your external drive over here and now you can try to install the game now still you are facing the problem in that case restore gaming root file in the drive so for this copy this link the link is provided in the video description open this link in a browser it will take you to my google drive i have uploaded dot gaming root file over here from my c drive so in my c drive i have this file that is gaming root so you can download this file and once the download is complete copy this file and then go to this pc open c drive and make a right click then paste this file over here in my case gaming root file is already there so make a right click then click on paste once you have this file now you can try to install the game now you can do the same thing with external drive so whichever drive you are trying to install the game go to that drive and then make a right click and then click on paste and then paste this gaming root file now try to install the game now still you are facing the problem in that case rename the drive now sometimes this also works now this works when when you go to this pc in file explorer when you see that the name over here is d and e so it has to be same so make a right click and then click on properties and then so it's d and it's showing e over here e d so just change it to d and then click on apply okay and refresh this now it's d and d so if you have if if the name of the uh, drive is showing like this d and in commas you have some other letter so make sure both the letters are same and then click on install and then you can select your drive now still you're facing the problem then now if in case if you don't see letter like this d in commas d if you don't see it you can skip this step you don't have to perform this step now the next step is to format the drive and while formatting select ntfs and then now before you perform for format make sure that you create a backup of all the data because format will result in loss of complete data and application so create a backup and then go for format to format open file explorer make a right click on the drive and then click on format and then over here select ntfs now if by default if ntfs is already selected you can select expat and then click on start if expat is selected you can select ntfs so I would recommend select NTFS. In my case, this is what has worked. So select NTFS and then click on start. Click on OK. Click on yes. 
and format complete close now you can go to xbox app and then try to install change it to select the drive you should be able to see the drive now this has worked for me so it might work for you so this exactly has worked for me but you will lose all the data on the drive so if you have the option to create a backup create a backup now after format if required you can select drive in windows settings and xbox app settings for this go to the start menu click on settings then system and then click on storage again advanced storage settings where new content is saved and then from here you can select the d drive and then go to xbox app on the top left click on your profile icon then settings general and over here you can go ahead and select your external drive and then try to download the game now the next step is to repair or reset xbox app to repair or reset type in xbox app in windows search box and then make a right click on xbox app and then click on app settings Now scroll down here you can see the repair option so click on repair and after the repair try to install the game to external drive still you are facing the problem then click on reset reset and after the reset you can try to install the game. Now the last step is to update windows 10 using media creation tool. If you have windows 10 copy this link if you have windows 11 copy this link windows 10 users go to this website here you can see media creation tool click on download tool now and then run this exe file then you will see the screen click on accept by default upgrade this pc now would be selected click on next it will start downloading windows 10 along with the latest update now this process will take some time now once the download is complete before the installation you will see the screen which says ready to install and by default the option to keep personal files and app would be checked when this is checked you will not lose any data on the computer so click on install and once the installation is complete log into your computer now for windows 11 users go to this website here also you will find media creation tool click on download now and then run this exe file click on yes to allow now this will load windows 11 media creation tool now click on accept by default windows 11 would be selected click on next select iso file then click on next you can save the location you can set the location as desktop and then click on save over here now once the download is complete click on finish and then go to desktop find windows iso file make a double click on windows iso file then run the setup file make a double click on setup file click on yes to allow this will load windows 11 now and here you can see install windows 11 click on next it will check for update then click on accept again it will check for update now before the installation you will see the screen which says ready to install and by default the option to keep personal files and app would be checked when this is checked you will not lose any data on the computer click on install after the installation log into your computer so one of the steps should help you to install the game to your external drive so that'll be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel